Hey everybody, it's Anna. Time for our final card in this week's tarot story. We have our third major arcana card, big life lesson. It is the chariot. So the chariot card, you might think it's all about power and it is a powerful card, right? There's this charioteer sitting in his chariot. He's got two large beasts that are just waiting for him to give them direction and they're gonna pull his chariot forward. He doesn't even have reins. That tells you that it's an intuitive thing. Once his mind decides where he's going, he's immediately going to be taken there. So chariots we think of as being just very bold and big and really energetic. But the key to this card, it's a seven card. And the seven is about um, discernment. It's about making wise decisions. This card is about making a decision. Where do you want to go? right? And that might seem easy, but it is surprisingly complicated for some of us. For one thing, many of us are not even aware of our own desires. We never ask ourselves what we want. That's a problem. Secondly, we have multiple things that we want. So that's a problem, right? Yesterday's card was the two of pentacles reversed. And I talked about how challenging it is to balance multiple agendas we've got going on in our lives. There are lots of things that are important to us. But I also suggested the way we find um, balance is by following our heart's wisdom, our intuition, because our heart values every area of our life and it's going to intuitively understand where energy needs to go, how much energy needs to go into different areas of our lives, which is going to change. So you can't just sit down and say, okay, I'm always going to spend three hours with my family and two hours at the gym. And, um, well, you can do that, but that's not the key to real balance. The key to balance is every day coming at your life from a position of a heart, asking what is needed today? What is needful for me today? And I think that's the key to this lesson as well. What was needful to you yesterday is not necessarily what is needful to, for you today. So if you're trying to make a decision that you think makes sense, you know, in general, that's probably not the helpful decision. The decision is, what do I really want right now? In this moment, where is my heart directing me? What are, where is my energy leading me? Even if it doesn't seem to make sense in the larger context of my life, right now, I'm following this very clear soul message, which is saying, this is what I'm doing. And when you are clear on that, when you are discerning very clearly what you want to do, this energy is available to you. The second you know what you're doing and you're aligned with your soul, the entire universe springs into action to carry you forward. But you have to commit really to listening to your soul and committing your full self to being faithful to that leading instead of thinking, well, I should be doing this and that person wants me to do this, all those multiple voices, that will never get you anywhere. So consider what it takes for you to really commit yourself fully to your highest spiritual good, to your highest, most abundant life, and ask yourself, what is the one thing you need to choose today that you're willing to choose with your full heart, your full mind, your full body, your full self in order to get this momentum in place? See you tomorrow. See you next week for our next tarot story. Bye.